The lunatic is in my head. <laughs> Good morning, afternoon, evening. Today we have another monumental moment of stupidity brought to you by the collective of elected idiots we have in Congress. That's right, this report features Nancy P. Lousy, or Pelosi, as her friends on the Hill like to call her, when earlier this week, in response to the looming sequestration on the horizon, she stated, we don't have a spending problem. We have a budget deficit problem, and she's not alone in this consensus. President Obama, Dick Durbin, Steny Hoyer, and Tom Harkin, to name a few, support Pelosi's opinion. The fact that government spending has jumped from around $1 billion a year in the, in the 60s to over $1 trillion a year during the past few years is completely lost on her and her cohorts. Hey, Madam Pelosi, you incur a budget deficit when you spend more than you have. But not to worry, they have a plan to fix all that. That's right. They plan to address the deficit, which means raising your taxes until you're left with nothing. In other words, based on a population of 350 million people in America and an annual deficit of $1.1 trillion, every man, woman, and child in America would need to be taxed $3,142,857 a year to eliminate the deficit. And that amount doesn't even begin to address the $87 trillion in our nation's unfunded liabilities, which would increase that burden on every man, woman, and child in America to approximately $270 million. I hope this puts this into perspective, the magnitude of the problem that they've gotten us into and the fact that they can't tax their way out of this. Oh, and by the way, with regard to a bill introduced to cut congressional salaries to stave off some of the automatic cuts that will go into effect when the sequestration takes effect, House Minority Leader Nancy P. Lousy said Thursday that she opposes a cut in congressional pay because it would diminish the dignity of lawmakers' jobs. She said, and I quote, I don't think we should do it. I think we should respect the work we do, Pelosi told reporters in the Capitol. I think it's necessary for us to have the dignity of the job and that we be rewarded for it. And that's today's Idiocracy Report for Sunday, February 17th, 2013. Please leave your comments for discussion below and please share this video. Thank you.